Okay, we're going to start with the definition of the conditional mean of y given x. We need to integrate over the support of y, which is x squared to 1, the function y times the conditional distribution of y given x. Now replacing what we know to be the conditional distribution of y given x, we get the integral of y times 1 over 1 minus x squared dy. Okay, now 1 over 1 minus x squared doesn't depend on y, so we can pull it through the integral, and we're left with integrating y dy over the support y from x squared to 1. That equals 1 over 1 minus x squared. Integrating the y, we get y squared over 2, and we need to evaluate that at y equals x squared and y equals 1. Well, doing that evaluating, we get 1 over 1 minus x squared times, when y is equal to 1, we get 1 squared over 2, which is a half. When y equals x squared, we get x squared squared, which is x to the fourth over 2. So we have y, we have 1 over 1 minus x squared times 1 minus x to the fourth over 2. Well, factoring out that 1 minus x to the fourth, Factoring 1 minus x to the 4, we get 1 minus x squared times 1 plus x squared. And then that allows us to cancel the 1 minus x squared in the numerator and the 1 minus x squared in the denominator. And we're therefore left with 1 plus x squared over 2.